West Mountain Radio presents Choosing the Correct Battery. This video is part of our UPS video series and will guide you through choosing the correct battery for a UPS system. At West Mountain Radio, we get asked many questions about backup battery systems for powering radio equipment. Some of the main reasons for wanting a UPS system are to provide emergency power during a temporary or sustained power outage, to prevent equipment damage from rapidly cycling power loss and brownouts, to comply with specific emergency radio services recommendations. The very first step in designing any UPS system is to consider the battery and what is expected of it. Factors which affect battery choice are safety, physical properties such as weight and size, and capacity, usually measured in AH or amp hours. Let's look at battery safety first. For inside use, we recommend only using a sealed lead acid battery. This is for two reasons. First, the acid is locked away in either a gel or the construction of the battery prevents acid from spilling. Second, during charging, hydrogen gas is mostly prevented from escaping. A buildup of hydrogen gas can lead to a risk of explosion or fire. The two main types of sealed lead acid battery are AGM, which stands for absorbed glass mat, and gel cells. Each type is perfectly usable for a radio UPS and each has their own advantages and disadvantages. Deep cycle gel cells can last approximately twice as long as an AGM battery. We recommend keeping an AGM battery charged and only infrequently discharging the battery below 60%. Gel cells are physically larger and considerably more expensive than equivalent capacity AGM. Gel cell batteries have better reliability in higher ambient operating temperatures and when current drain is low over an extended time. Now, let's look at battery capacity. This is an important concept which has to be understood to properly design our UPS. Capacity is measured in ampere hours, AH, and very broadly speaking equates to the amount of current which can be drawn per time period. For instance, a 75 AH battery might be expected to provide 75 amps continuously for one hour, or to look at it another way, one amp for 75 hours. In practice, Capacity isn't as cut and dried as these examples would lead you to believe. Depending on current draw, temperature, and other factors, capacity will be somewhat different. Battery manufacturers will typically specify the AH capacity at the 20 hour standard rate. This makes comparing batteries much easier. Let's look at a data sheet for a typical 75 ampere hour battery. At the standard 20 hour discharge rate, our capacity is 75 AH. At a 5 hour discharge rate, our capacity drops to 68 AH. And at the 1 hour discharge rate, our effective capacity becomes 47 AH. The takeaway from this chart is the higher the discharge, the lower the battery capacity. Regarding the terminal voltage, it is also apparent that for lower discharge rates over increased time, we must be careful to avoid running the battery too low. This condition will permanently damage the battery. Trying to calculate exactly what size battery you need is very challenging because there are so many factors that need to be considered. We recommend choosing the largest capacity battery your budget will support for a 100 watt class radio. Nothing less than 75 ampere hours should be considered unless you're using it for a very brief period of time or reception only. For more information on some good batteries for amateur radio use, visit the West Mountain Radio website. Using the Super Power Gate PG40S, which is an automatic switch, and an appropriately sized lead acid battery, it will enable the instantaneous changeover from main power to battery power should the AC supply be interrupted. During times of normal AC supply, the backup battery is being charged or on float, thereby always providing a fully charged battery for when the AC supply is lost. 
Note that for demo purposes we are using a 7.5 AH lead acid battery. We do not recommend using a battery this size for your UPS. To learn about the products West Mountain Radio offers for a UPS system, we invite you to watch another video from our UPS series entitled DC Power, the West Mountain Radio Way, where we take a closer look at the PG40S, Power Check, Power Guard Plus, and the Rig Runner 4008.